What's up, everybody, man? It's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another video, man. <laughs> and today, man, I'm going to talk about tonight's game. You had the Baltimore Ravens beating the Los Angeles Chargers 22 to 10. Man, bro, like, this, this, this was a very interesting football game, man. You know, it wasn't, wasn't the most high-powered, wasn't the, the greatest scoring game. It was a very defensive football game, especially in the first half. You know, the um the Ravens came down. You know, after the first after the interception early on by Brandon Carr, the Ravens came down. Justin Tucker hit a field goal. Then later on, Justin Tucker hit another field goal after missing one. And then right before the half, the uh, well, yeah, later in the half, the Chargers ended up getting the field goal to cut it to six to three at the half. Like, early on in the uh, the second half, I want to say the first, yeah, the very first play of the second half, Kenneth Dixon fumbles the ball for the Ravens, and Melvin Ingram from the Chargers picks it up. And, like, a few plays later, Melvin Garton rushes in to the, to the end zone to give the Chargers a 10-6 lead. Ravens get the ball back, man, and then Lamar Jackson makes just – you know, an absolute beautiful throw in stride right on the money in, like, a place you couldn't put it any better. He threw a perfect pass to um, Mark Andrews, who st stiffed on the defender and streaked down the sideline for a 70-something-yard touchdown, you know, to give the Ravens a 13-10 lead. You know, then later in the game, you know, Justin Tucker added another field goal to make it a 16-10 to 10 lead. Then the, the, the Chargers get the ball back late in the game, trying to go on a drive to, to pull it out. And number 48 for the Ravens, I, I'm sorry, but I don't, I don't remember his name. He punches the ball out of Antonio Gay's hand. And I want to say his name was Tavon Young, picks it up and streaks down the sideline to give the Ravens a 22 to 10 lead. It's so ironic that, you know, as old as Antonio Gates is, he fumbles the ball and is picked up and brought in by a guy named Young. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, but yeah, uh, Chargers get the ball again, can't do nothing with it, and the Ravens close it out 22 to 10 to get a huge, huge upset win on the road you know, to put them in prime position, not only to, to have the sixth seed, but they're in a great position to win the AFC North if the Steelers lose in New Orleans tomorrow. Um, they, man, the, the, the way they run in the football, you know, Lamar Jackson with, with timely throws, you know, the defense plays spectacular tonight, man. Their defense played real spectacular, holding this, this very hot Chargers team to just 10 points. And the touchdown they got basically was off of a, a, a fumble recovery that already put them in the red zone. This Ravens, they, they made a statement that night, starting with the first play of the game when Brandon Carr took the ball clean away from Mike Williams. Uh, Edward Edwards running the ball. Dix, I know you had the fumble, but Dixon running the ball. Those those two rookie tight ends getting it done. Jackson running the ball, and defensively just getting after it. Like this is a dangerous Baltimore team with a unique style of football. And as far as the Chargers, it's a disappointing loss because I felt like. If they'd have pulled it out tonight, they had a really good chance to end up with the number one seed. You know, and uh, yeah, they just couldn't get it going offensively. Like when they early on, it was a kind of a questionable offensive pass in the first call on Keenan Allen. Then they hit Mike Williams on a seam throw, but Keenan Allen was still arguing with the refs. Uh, they they had a good pass rush. They was physical. The Chargers just they just didn't match the Ravens' physicality tonight. You know, they got Melvin Garden back, but for the most part, you know, they didn't run the ball great tonight. Defensively, they played okay. You know, yeah, they got ran on a good bit, but they played okay. They played well enough, basically, to, to still win the football game. 
they they just got it done. You know, they, 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 the Ravens just got it done. And the Chargers just fell short. You know, they already clinched, clinched a playoff berth. But it's definitely now looking like they're going to end up being a wild card team going on the, going on the road. You know, but um, shout out to the Ravens, man. Big win for them. They actually look like they got a real shot at this AFC North now. And for the Chargers, you know, they're still in the playoffs. But it was a tough loss as far as them winning the AFC West and possibly getting home for the advantage. But um, but with that being said, man, that's all I got for y'all tonight. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Go on, give me a subscribe. I'm going to have NFL content throughout the season. Y'all have a blessed one. Fly, Eagles, fly.